Okay, look, I can tell you firsthand that everybody deals with breakups differently. Oh, yeah. But one of the most iconic things I've ever heard of is forming a rock band based on the insult that your ex tried to dish out to you during a split. Yeah, he thought it was an insult. He thought Okay, insult. so that's only part of the origin story of our guest band. We are so thrilled to be sitting here with Evelyn, Michelle, Maya, Christy, Siona, collectively Garbage Girlfriend. Ladies, welcome to the show. Hi, welcome. Hello. We're so glad to have you here. So some of our viewers uh, might recognize you, Evelyn. You've been on Houston Life a couple times. Yes. Refresh our, our memory about the breakup. It, essentially, a boyfriend called you the Garbage Girlfriend? My very first ex-boyfriend, I broke up with him and he didn't like that, so he called me a Garbage Girlfriend. And I decided that, that would be a great band name and so I formed a band. And here you are today, competing for the chance to go to New York City. I mean, this is a huge contest. What's it all about? The opening act contest is basically, essentially, a whole contest for bands all around America to be able to go through multiple rounds of voting to open up for Kelly Clarkson, um, Maroon 5, and One Republic at a music festival in New York City. Wow. Not bad. So that's a big opportunity. You guys are currently yes. second in the voting, right? So this is it. It's a We Can Survive. It's sponsored by Odyssey. And it's a, it, we would love to have someone from the hometown, from the H, or specifically Katie, getting in there. Um, and you guys, I mean, you're young, and the bands are a lot older than you, but you have a, a pretty impressive resume. Chrissy, what kind of stuff? I mean, brag on yourself. What kind of uh, words and stuff have you won? Um, so in March, uh, we performed at the Rodeo, Rodeo Rockstar, and we got third place. Awesome. And about two weeks later, we went to Waller County to uh, for Battle of the Bands, and we won that. Nice. And then uh, we performed at a lot of other venues like Typhoon, Texas, Cedar Creek, uh, Cadia Bar and Grill, and then also in October, we will be performing at the Rice Festival. Nice, nice. So yeah, they've got a resume, and it doesn't matter that y'all are young, y'all are rocking. Well, and also what I think is so cool, we're seeing some video of some of those performances. Uh, being a teenager is not easy, right? And schooling is a full-time job by itself. So how do y'all find time to, to get together and rehearse? We have to communicate a lot. A lot of stuff that's helpful for us is we have band calendars, where we all have access and kind of can plan around all our lives and stuff. Wow. Well, you got to stay organized, right? Michelle, you are 17. Yes. You're the oldest in the group. You're mm -hmm. a vocalist. Mm -hmm. uh, what's it like to just find your groove with with a group of girls? You guys are friends in real life. Yeah. But of you course. also like. Do, do you think that that fuels your your synergy, your creativity? No, totally. Yeah. I think that it's so cool when girls can just get together and really girl boss and really have that girl power. Um, so that's what it feels like to really be a part of that, which is really special because you don't really see many bands composed of just girls. So that's true. what song are you guys gonna perform for us, Michelle? Well, it's called The Girl You Dreamt Up. Oh, and is the lyric, I mean, did you guys write this collectively? How does the songwriting process go? Well, essentially, we just kind of jammed. Uh, we're strumming some chords, a chord progression, and I kind of came up with a melody, and it kind of sounded like siren-y. Okay. So I was like, okay, okay, I, I see this. So I kind of made words surrounding that idea, and that's kind of how the, um, the song formed, and then we collaborated, talked about which direction we wanted to take it, and that kind of stuff. Okay, we now can't we wait know. to hear it. Yeah. Well, while y'all get ready, we want to let our viewers know how they can vote. If you would like to help these women win the opening act contest, all you need to do is vote on the link we have shared on our website, HoustonLife.tv. Look for that scene on Houston Life section. Voting is fast, easy, and free, but you have it until tonight, September 7th at 10 p.m. Central to do so. If you want to, you can also buy extra votes as part of the We Can Survive Concerts fundraiser for the American Foundation for Suicide Prevention. Such, a, such an important cause. Get in there and vote. Uh, let's get these girls in. And now it's time to hear the band perform live here to debut their first original song called The girl you dreamt of. Let's give it up right now for Garbage Girlfriend.
Evelyn, Michelle, Maya, Christy, and Siona with Garbage Girlfriend. Thank you. Best of luck in the competition. We'll be right back. That was awesome.